Hello again, my name is Bruce Clow. I run Cirrusel Beekeeping Supplies. Today we're going to talk about setting up the Cirrusel Round Comb Honey System. Now besides the actual frames and rings that we're going to be dealing with, we need foundation and usually it's Thin Super. So here we have Thin Super um, in three different sizes, half depth, three quarter and full depth. Often Thin Super is uh, bleached. Um, but it needn't be. In this case, the half depth and three quarter is bleached and the full depth is unbleached. So for the Cirrusel round system, uh, it's most convenient to use half depth, so we're gonna use that. So here you can see, we're just reusing the frames that we used last season. We just need to insert the, the white rings. Now the white rings have a little ridge on them that slip in and there's little guide nibs in the frame so that the ridge and the nick will end up forming a parallel line, a line parallel to the, the top and bottom of the frame. So let's just go ahead and put all these rings into the, the frame. And you can see the, the nicks are forming a line parallel to the top and bottom. The top edge of that white ring should be flush with the edge of the frame that we're putting them into. And once we have all those rings in, we're gonna insert a piece of foundation. So you can see the half depth is a nice size for fitting the Cirrusel rounds, but we need to trim the corners because there's the joining pegs on each of the frames that we want to get past the foundation. So we'll just trim the corners off. And so once we've snipped all four corners of that foundation, we just lift the other half, lay it on top, just press it in together, and then we've just got one edge that we need to trim. So we'll trim that bit of foundation off, and it's ready to load into our specially adapted comb honey box. Just slip that in there, it should be a nice snug fit. And this is the final product we're looking for. Beautiful New Zealand comb honey. 